Hello guys, welcome to our channel. Today we're going to see how to install WordPress uh, plugin called Elementor. Elementor is the most popular page builder plugin and today we are going to see how to install it. And um, at first you need to go to just a few minutes before I have just installed a fresh WordPress, WordPress and it's a six point two point two version and this is a fresh windows just you need to go to dashboard and find plugins mm, click on it and uh, just add new you can use this one also you can directly use plugin add new just like this okay click on it right side of this church plugins input box you need to write Elementor write and enter you need to don't need to enter it will automatically charge for you and see this is our Elementor we which one we are expected to install click on it this is just fresh install it will take a few seconds maybe it depends on your PC or Mac configuration my one is done already just click on active activate You don't need to use anything. Mm. You are here. I I'll recommend. I'll suggest you to read every single uh, content or every single page. No need to worry. You you need you just need to follow follow me. You it will be everything will be okay. Click on it. Close button. Find Elementor. Yes, this is settings. Type post. That means where you will use about uh, use it. If you uh, want to use only for post, you can you can choose. You just need to take out this red mark. And if you need to use only for pages, just need to take out this one. And uh, don't forget to click on save changes. I'm not going to do change anything so uh, so this is API key and uh, this is advanced CSS print method external uh, file no need to change anything just uh, we need to test this plugin is working or not right so and this uh, for that reason you need to create a page page hover on it and uh, click add new so yeah we have we have came at Gutenberg welcome to the block editor next they are showing you some information about how to use it or how to benefit about it next block yes get started you need to give a name mm, that means page name in this case we are going to give a name elementor it can be about it can be contact it can be home page it can be services whatever you want you just need to write your name and just click on publish again you can visit the page right click and click on it this new tab is opened there is nothing right so you just need to edit with elementor button click on it elementor will be open okay no need to do anything just click the close button again 
and you are already you have already came at Elementor interface this is navigator it's like uh, if you are a designer or something illustrator uh, maybe you have used Photoshop or like something it's it's type of uh, layer I'll show you if you click on it navigator it's uh, will pop up and again you will click this pop up will be removed so you can use the mobile view responsive you can test here and uh, no need to do this okay just you need to we need to uh, check this our element is working fine you can oriented layout which layout you want to use only one column two column three column four column or another types of as your requirement you can choose any of this we are not going to do anything just we need to click one column so it's not going everywhere so you need to click on stretch section and we are going to click see on top of the right uh, left um, area left side there on top right this is dot dot click on it and see all of the add-ons here which one is already locked you can't use it free so we can use this one heading this is our first heading you can change color you can change anything whatever you want update came here and reload it see our elementary is working fine perfectly that's it see you in the next video till then stay well keep learning